day, they're still setting up rides, and as, if you uh, pan out or, uh, along the midway, you see lots of rides that are being set up, and they're in various stages of completion. Jim Borway is a state amusement ride inspector. He's out here while they're setting up to make sure everything's done correctly. Just like uh, building any house, you look at a firm foundation, and you will notice that you have blocking here made of two by fours. This fun house isn't done being set up yet. Borway says when he does the final inspection tomorrow, he's going to make sure there are no spare bolts lying around and make sure that these two pieces are connected properly. One of the rules of thumb, I guess, is if you see a hole, you need to fill it with something. And, and so most they don't put extra holes in the equipment. The rides have their own safety features. For example, the motors on the bumper boats have cages around its propellers. On the ride itself, we look at all the fencing and all the scenery to make sure that there's no sharp edges and places where kids are going to cut their fingers. The ride operators say setting it up properly isn't the only thing that's going to keep you safe. Follow the rules. The rules are there for your safety. They're not there to be mean. They're there so that you can be safe. Because you can't have fun if you're not being safe.